Hi everyone, this is uh, the Sacred Cow Tipper. Uh, I, I got a discovery here that I've made recently that has just, uh, things have gone to a new low. I, I just can't believe what I've seen on the shelf at the Christian Bookstore this week. It's, the, it's called the Create your own Jesus Bible version. I actually picked one up. Here it is. Okay, it's backwards because the uh, camera there. Okay, so this is the Create Your Own Jesus Bible version. And <clears throat> what's amazing about it is we've been talking a lot about how everybody has a uh, Forgetting about what the, what words Jesus actually said, uh, they say it's irrelevant today, which is amazing because <laughs> this particular Bible has a postmodern key study Bible. Now I don't, uh, I'm not sure if this was put out by the Emergent Church movement. I'm not sure uh, who put this out at this point. But it has a postmodern key study Bible, and pretty much what uh, what postmodernism is, is, nothing's really relevant. You know, everything's irrelevant. Pretty much, it's uh, whatever you believe truth is. So, in other words, you could put your own um, interpretation on Scripture. Yet Peter said that. Uh, we have a sure word of prophecy and that there's no private interpretation that is to be put on scripture okay so we know God's word is like an owner's manual and that's if if you got an owner's manual and you can't go by it if you can't trust it what good is it you know if, if I'm the Maytag repairman and I get a call to go out and fix a say a dishwasher okay and I get it. I get out there. I get my owner's manual out on that particular model, and it's empty. Well, what good is it? If there's nothing written on the pages, what good is it? Uh, that's no different than having a manual and not using it. Okay. A lot of people say you can't judge prophecy. You can't judge. Uh, things that are being done within the churches in America you you can't do any of this stuff anymore uh, you just gotta swallow it hook line and sinker okay but as I'm uh, checking out this Bible it's pretty interesting it's made with soy and tofu can you believe that the pages are made of soy and tofu yeah, I, I had to buy this because I, it was so shocking. I'll probably return it after doing the video, but I had to buy it just for the sake of, of proving this thing exists. Okay? Uh, on the back, it says, No animals were harmed when making this Bible non-genuine bonded leather. Now, that's that's pretty wild. Okay, um, so I don't know. Uh, it's it's the instead of like KJV for King James Version, it's C Y O J V, which stands for Create Your Own Jesus Version. Okay, so they're basically telling us to create our own Bible version. I I don't know if that bothers you, but that bothers me a lot, and um, I'm probably gonna do a few more videos on this. And uh, I don't know what else to say. I, I think Christianity in America uh, has come to a new low. And <clears throat> I don't know, there needs to be repentance. We, we need to get back to the Bible, the true Bible. Read it and obey it. We need to read the words of Jesus and obey his words also. Okay, so... I guess place your comments here. Let me know what you think. Uh, it's pretty shocking to me. And I hope it shocks uh, the majority, if not all, of my uh, listeners and, and my uh, those who read my articles. All right, you have a good day. 
and uh, hope things look up tomorrow. All right.